Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel or hello if you are new, I'm Erin and I am a professional bodybuilder and I am one day post show. I competed in the Orlando Pro yesterday and I have been on a diet since January. 2021. I am needing this today, that's for sure. Today is going to be a cheat day. I hate the word cheat, but it is going to be a day where I give myself permission to eat whatever I want. Completely guilt-free, no stress, and I'm not going to hold back. If I want to have five donuts or ten donuts, I'll have that. Like, I am just going to let myself have one day completely off plan. Now, I'm not going to be binging, I'm not going to be eating past discomfort, but I can eat a lot of food. I can put a lot of food back. It's actually quite scary, to be honest. I don't really get, like, that full feeling that you get after consuming a big meal. Like, last night we went to the Outback Steakhouse. We all got three huge starters. We all had steaks and we all had like cookies and Oreos, etc. as well. And it, it didn't even touch the sides, to be honest. <laughs> so today I am going to go explore Orlando. I am from Scotland, so being in America and being around all the American food, I, I can't put this opportunity to waste. <laughs> so I am going to enjoy it. It is half past six. I'll give you guys a little physique update um, and I'll give you a little weight update as well. And then first stop is going to be heading to Krispy Kreme. 54 kilos we are weighing in on. interested to see what I actually look like tomorrow and over the next couple of days. I'm going to document the whole process so you can see what my body goes through after a full day of eating whatever I want. But let's get dressed, let's get ready and let's head to Krispy Kreme. So I'm going to be starting the day with a box of Fruity Pebbles because this is a cereal that we don't have in the UK and I have been desperate to try them. So I'm going to have a bowl of these. Now, I'm not going to be tracking the calories as I go because then I think mentally that'll just affect me a little bit. But I'm going to tally everything up at the end and I'll you guys will get to see how much calories I'm consuming throughout the day. But I'm just going to be eating to fullness. I'm not going to be eating past fullness and I'm just going to be enjoying every single second. So we'll have a bowl of this and then we will head to Krispy Kreme. Just so I can keep track at the end, we'll have 40 grams of this, some almond breeze. This is amazing. You don't get this in the UK, it's vanilla flavored. Oh my goodness, look at this guys. Oh my god. Wow. Oh, that look at charms. Yum. I'm not even sure what they taste like. Delicious anyway. Wow. Mmm. I love cereal so much. I never eat it though. Like I love food, but because I'm a bodybuilder, I literally eat the same foods every single day. So this is luxury to me. Wow. I am going to have the best day today. Let's see what this top looks like by the end of the day as well. For anybody that knows me, I am the messiest person ever. So it's probably going to be covered. 
right. That was delicious. I'm excited for a coffee today as well. Because in peak week, you cut out like artificial sweeteners and obviously the day before a show, you're, you're manipulating your water and everything as well. So I'm just excited to drink fluids today. I've also got one of these to drink. Again, the UK doesn't have these, so I'm excited to try that. The hot light is on. The hot light is on. Exciting. Or not, I have actually only ever had two donuts in my whole life. One was from donut time in London, and I think I've only ever had one Krispy Kreme. Oh, look at these. Wow. So, I came when the hot light was on. The original glazed donuts are hot. My goodness. Why did I not charge my camera? I'm going to have to go home. Charge my camera. And then come back out. But just fine. Right. I've got all the... It's been so easy. And then... I forgot to show you this one. This is a filled one as well. Ooh. Blue filling. So while my camera was charging, I nipped out to Dunkin' Donuts and got an apple fritter because I have been wanting to try one of these for so long. I was gutted when they wasn't in Krispy Kreme. So I'm going to eat this before I go head out for breakfast. Look at that. It smells unbelievable. Mmm. I thought it would be bits of, of apple in it, to be fair. 
Is there? Oh, there may be actually. Oh, there we go. Yum. Wow. Wow. Unbelievable. Wonder if I heated it up in the microwave for 30 seconds. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God, it is hot. Wow. That is unbelievable. It is really hot though. That is sensational. Look at that. Today is a good day. Ten out of ten. Unbelievable. So we are at Kiki's breakfast bar. I don't know if you can see this. Yeah, we've got waffles at the top there. All the calories is on the menu as well, which is mental. We've then got the pancakes. So there's loads of different options there. Combo, French toast. Now, that apple and cinnamon French toast sounds unbelievable. And there's stuffed French toast as well, which also sounds mental. I have ordered my omelette, so rather than the Hawaiian with the, the ham, I'm not the biggest fan of ham, however I love pineapple, so what I've done instead is I'm going to have pineapple and onion and cheese omelette. So it'll probably be still around like, I would imagine it'll be around 600 calories, maybe a ham's a little bit more, although all of the omelettes are around like 500 to 700 calories. So I'll, I'll just I'll just put it in as a, a ham and pineapple omelette, omelet, but I'm so excited for this. I've also got a big pint of water and then an Americano. I've got a coffee, but they gave me this. Now in the UK we don't have half and half. We've just got like semi skimmed milk. So what is this? Hazelnut. Hazelnut milk. French vanilla. It's going in. Oh my god. Part one. Pineapple and onion and cheese omelette with potatoes and whole wheat bread. It's so annoying that it's not hot. Like it's actually stone cold. couldn't decide if I wanted pancakes or french toast so I've got one slice of the apple cinnamon french toast with two buttermilk pancakes with strawberries on the side I couldn't make up my mind so I'm going to have both <laughs> oh my goodness which I'll be mental but it's, it's fine <laughs> hasn't even touched the sides 
me as well just eat it. I'm like a bottomless pit. Oh my god. Apple and cinnamon French toast. And pancakes. Wow. These are thick pancakes. I'll show you. They are thick. That was absolutely incredible. Apart from the fact that my omelette was a little bit cold and they didn't have a microwave to be able to heat it up. So I just had to deal with it. But that was really good. I'm not sure what was my favorite. The pancakes were so fluffy and oh, they were amazing. And then the, the French toast was exceptional as well. So that's breakfast done. That was probably about maybe two and a half, three thousand calories. The French toast for two bits was 870, and then the pancakes were like around about the same as well. So yeah, it was probably a very calorie dense breakfast. So I'm gonna wait to go, go to the shops, get lots of steps in, and then I've no idea what I'm going to be doing next. But I feel good. I did think that I was starting to get full, like I could start to feel my stomach get, get full when I was halfway through that first pancake, but it, was, it wasn't like I was eating past like proper fullness, like making myself sick. It was just like, you know, what, like when, you, when you're eating Christmas dinner and you've got like the last little bit and you're, you, you need to finish it. So yeah, I feel, I feel good. A few steps and we'll be, we'll be ready to rock again. Okay guys, it is half past three. So it has been a couple of hours since I've been to Kiki. So I have done a bit of shopping. I have got a coffee frappuccino with sugar-free cinnamon, sugar-free cinnamon and non-fat milk. Unbelievable. And cheesecake factory, white chocolate, white chocolate and raspberry. Now it looks quite small, but supposedly, supposedly these cheesecakes are like a thousand calories. It is so, so weird vlogging in public. I am currently in the Mall of Millennia. Look at that. It's like a, it's like an Oreo base. Let me see if I can get a, there we go. That's the base of it. Excuse the color of my tan, my hand. So guys, this is the tan from yesterday. It 
is so so light. There is no way this is a thousand calories. I could probably eat maybe three of these. but if you take away who knows okay so we are back to the room I now need to figure out what I'm going to have for dinner do I want to have pizza or do I want to have a burger I think I want a burger I think Let's have a look. So while I'm deciding if I'm going to have a pizza or a burger, I'm just going to have three of these. If I can get into them. These are unreal. Oh wait, how much? Two cookies? Oh, I better have four then. So I'll have four. It's 140 calories. Just for easiness. I'll have four of these. Oh. Four of these? I have no idea why. I'm, I'm not full, I'm not bloated, I feel fine, very very strange, I have no idea how much calories I've ate but it'll be interesting when I do tally this all up, these are unreal, mmm, I think it's got to be burger. I love Domino's, but I'm not coming over to America to have Domino's pizza. There's so many restaurants. These are unreal. So good. I wonder how much I weigh right now. I'm not going to weigh myself. I can't be bothered taking off my shoes. Burger. Mmm. Let's do it. To be honest though, I don't actually look that bad. I'm vascular. Quads are there. My body's loving this. Yeah, I feel fine. <laughs> Chill as it is. I was going to have pizza, but I just love Domino's so much and I need to eat somewhere. So I'm going to, where to I here? I don't think I've ever ate here before. Table for one, please. Well, you've got some egg rolls. <laughs> There's chicken, there's beans, chili I think, sweet corn. Went into eight. I'm going to go to Disney Springs for a little bit, 
but I've calculated all of the food that I've consumed today so far. So 7,500, we've got the Fruity Pebbles, the cookies that I had before I went to Chili's, our donuts. I didn't add in that half donut that I didn't eat though, because it was, it was like a half or three quarters, so I've just skipped that out. So there, I've probably ate a little bit more than that. And then the pancakes, the, the, the potatoes, the omelette, the French toast, then we had the cheesecake from the Cheesecake Factory. Then we had our chilies. So the egg rolls, I've done it without the sauce because I didn't eat all the sauce. And then the burger and then the fries. So that's not bad. I feel fine. I've not ate past discomfort. I feel fine. I just, obviously right now I'm feeling a little bit full. But once I start walking and once I get moving again and digestion <laughs> digestion will start to move a little bit i'll be fine hello can i get a fruity pebble please we got the cereal that i had this morning on a glazed donut pink icing on the top So we have got brown sugar cinnamon toast. So I'm going to have a couple of bits of this with lotus, nut butter and jam. Weigh the lotus out so we know how much is going on. 10 grams on there. And then 10 grams on this one. A little bit of jam. So good. Hopefully this doesn't die. Now I'll tally it up. Get ready for bed. And then maybe have a couple of cookies to tie me over. And hopefully we'll maybe be at ten thousand. That is insane. I wish we got this kind of food in the UK. We've not came this far to only come this far. Peanut butter and jam on that one. We're putting lotus on this one. Right, so I've got 15 grams of lotus on there. Peanut butter and jam on there. And six cookies. I'm going to heat in the microwave. I do need ice cream with this, like. Five hundred calories to go. That should be easy, shouldn't it? Two hundred ten. One six five nine. So if I add in. That cereal, fruity pebbles, and easy calories, 40 grams. Bigger bowl than 40. 40, 80, 90, 90. That takes me to 10,026 calories. 90 grams of cereal. And we're done, boy. <laughs> right, 90 grams. 91 grams of cereal. So, 
over that in. Done. We are done. Finished for the day. And yes, I did eat my cereal like the same bowl I had my cookies in. I am done. Yes, my stomach feels full, but I don't feel, I don't feel really, really full. But it'll be interesting to see what happens over the next couple of days, but my camera battery is flashing at me again, so I will catch up with you all in the morning. But we've got a very full stomach. <sighs> Lot of food in there. <laughs> uh, that's because I just ate a load at once. I think that was like, God knows. But yeah, I will catch up with you all in the morning. Let's do a quick pre-bed weigh-in actually. 8.7. So what's that, four kilos up since this morning? Two, four, six, eight. It's not bad. <laughs> we'll see what it is tomorrow. It is the day after my amazing food festival and 10,000 calorie challenge all in one. Feel like my body is in agony. Like I can feel the water retention around my back, around my midsection, in my face. Like my skin feels really, really sore to touch. I just feel exhausted. I feel like I'm getting a headache coming on as well, but I know that after I do this weigh-in, I'm going to drink a load of water, and then I'm just going to get back to my normal diet today. I may actually eat a little bit less. I'm going to eat to, to hunger. Of course, I actually woke up and I was a little bit hungry this morning, but uh, I am just going to listen to my body. I'm just going to basically go back to my diet prior to prior to starting the, the challenge and we'll basically keep track over the next couple of days and see how long it takes my body to, to return back to baseline. They're looking like in this mirror. So my waist is definitely tightened up a little bit. Yeah, like my stomach, my stomach feels like sort of touch, but I think if I drink a load of water today, that, that'll really help. But let's weigh ourselves. Let's weigh ourselves and see what we're going to be. 56.55. 56.55. 56.55. kilos. Oh my God. Oh my God. So yeah, that is the update, two days post show. I think I'm just going to wrap this video up here because I've just proven to myself that it took me only two days to return back to baseline, which is, which is crazy. I'm happy with what I'm looking like and I'm ready to start my reverse now. So food is going up really, really high now. I'm going to have to eat a hell of a lot of, hell of a hell of a lot of food if I want to gain tissue. So thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you all was entertained by my first ever 10,000 calories consumed in a day. I'll maybe do a video of me actually trying and see how much calories I can actually get in in one day. Let me know, comment down below if you think I should do a 15,000 calorie challenge um, because I would be up for that. But please remember to like, please remember to subscribe because there's probably going to be more videos like this coming because I have really, really enjoyed myself. But yeah, I hope you all have the best day.